What's up everybody, this is Tadpole Superhero, and for the first time in forever, we're playing as Anna from Frozen. To find a point oh yeah, I've been waiting for a chance to, to break out into song. I hope I didn't hurt anybody's ears. But today, we're going to be heading into the interior part of the toy box. So I'll see you guys inside this lovely little fantasy cottage. It's going to be really fun. So guys, I'm going to be honest, I may break into break into song more often the more I play this game. Uh, whoa! We didn't have stairs for a second there. Oh, man. Alright, so this is our interior. Now, I actually, I've only done one thing so far, which is kind of changed the theme of the interior. So that it's like Rapunzel's Tower from Tangled. But otherwise, I've done nothing. So all this furniture, everything. This is... The section of the game called My Interior. So you can. To talk oh, to your guests. Dude, narrator. I was, I was trying to talk to people. I don't want to talk to the guests. I want to talk to the viewers. So. Well, this is your. The My Interior section of the toy box. This is an adorable little nook. Look at this. This is so cute. Just chill by the window. Look out over the stairs. Oh, I love it. But, so this is the only interior set in the entire game. You only get one save file that has this giant lobby to open up. But you can also create interiors that are just, that are just like chill interiors. They're just chill, like they're just, yeah. That they don't have this big open lobby. I wish you could put the lobby into any interior. But it's only in the my interior section. So anyway, we're playing as Anna. She is adorable. She's got her streak of white hair from the movie, from the start of the movie. Uh, so yeah, what we can do, this is going to be a little more of a relaxing episode. We're just going to be fooling around, building out a house, building our dream, our Disney dream home. That's what this is all about. And we may break into song. Uh, we may just hang out and have fun. I may just kind of... You know, blog a little bit. Just tell you guys what's going on in life. So anyway, let's talk to this guy. Okay, so... Ready. Really? Ready for anything, Anna. That's me. I believe it. You are always ready for anything. Sidekick sweet. So, okay. So we see lots of closed doors. And we can add rooms in the editor. So this is the first video ever that had on this channel that showed off the editor so let's go up to so you can add all kinds of stuff you can add rugs you can add electronics and appliances but what we want to start with is adding rooms where we go whoosh we go into space and here we are outside of the house so look at how beautiful it is outside i wish you could actually place that uh exterior just like the front facade into a world and be like this is my okay yeah i did i did add um a vault behind the the bookcase I'll show you guys that I forgot about that I pl I've, I had thought I deleted everything because I played around in this a little bit and then I was like no nah, I want to save it for when I record um, so oops sorry about that so anyway we're on uh, we have a bunch of different rooms we need to add the sidekick suite but we're not gonna do that just yet because I want to build out to it so what we can do look at all these rooms we can add but we are going to start with, I think that there are hallways, right? Yes. So we're going to add a hallway. And the sidekick suite, um, where do we want to put it? I'm going to put it on the bottom floor or the second floor. Let's put it on the second floor. Or actually, okay, hang on. Let's delete some rooms. So this is spark mode. You can delete stuff. Uh, so we're going to delete the money bin. Don't worry. We'll recreate it. Those, the characters with with uh, parachutes are little townspeople that were hanging out in there and now they're floating uh, forever in space. They will never return. <laughs> All right, let's, uh, yeah, let's do this. Oh goodness, that was interesting. Okay, so that is behind the bookcase, right? Right, no, that's the side, okay. This is behind the bookcase, yes. So we're gonna build out behind the bookcase build and we're gonna go another level lower so let's have a pipe climb room that'll be fun so even though it shows it with just two floors you can actually add these 
ascending and descending rooms to give yourself even more floors. Uh, and let's do one more long haul. And we can do an intersection. Uh, yeah. Because I want to build out some more stuff behind there. I want to put the vault back behind there, but we'll get to that. So I'll put the sidekick suite right here. Coolio. All right. So in the my interior, you run into your sidekicks can be given their Hello. very own rooms okay. in your interior. Throw one into this door to assign it to this room. That sidekick will then. Oh, that is room cool. To We're gonna throw a Scrooge in there. We're gonna have a Scrooge McDuck room. Good one. So yeah, you can talk to characters in the my interior section, and they'll give you quests to do. So actually, these people are like, hey, look, it's Elsa. Uh, so she. Ka and Winnie the Pooh sound identical. Wait, did they have the same voice actors? That's cool. In the movies. I had no idea. Uh, okay. So, the people with just speech bubbles, they just have, like, interesting or not interesting things to say, depending on who it is. Like Darkwing Duck over here. He's probably got something cool to say. There's more to some things than meets the eye. Approach the bookcase and see for yourself. Let's check this out. We have a secret door behind the bookcase. How awesome is that? So, let's jump down. Huh! All right, so we have this split, and this goes to, oh, hello. Sidekick suite, so let's go, oh wait, hang on, no, 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 no. I didn't want to go to the editor, stop it. Okay, let's go to our sidekicks menu, and bring Scrooge into the world. What's up, Scrooge? Hey, what, no, pick it up. And then you can see the little targeting reticle over the door. Whee! We throw him in, and he is going to decorate the room to his own tastes. So let's wait, I can't, I can't wait. I'm so excited. Did you do it? Did you do it? Oh my gosh! He made a room! Where's the stuff? Oh, it's it's still building. Whoa. Scrooge Scrooge has got a thing for sleeping beauty. Alright. That's uh that's good to know. Oh I love that stained glass effect. Look at that. There's dust floating in front of it and then it creates an image on the floor. I love it. And we got a we got an arcade game. Which one is that? Oh that's Fix It Felix Jr. Cool. He's got a vending machine because Scrooge McDuck gets thirsty and uh, he really likes Han Solo. <laughs> He's a big fan of Han Solo. Oh, that's the that's the that's the floral arrangement from the Snuggly Duckling in Tangled. I'm getting a little fanboyish. Tangled's Tangled's my fave. All right, Ace of Hearts. Scrooge is into hearts. He's into lovey-dovey stuff and s skulls and Han Solo. Scrooge is an eclectic character. And he's got the Captain America clock from Iron Man. I had a tree. Oh, gosh. <laughs> That's from the Snuggly Duckling and Tangled 2. Oh, my gosh. You can put that in the... You can put this in your toy box? Yeah, because this area is built out of decorations that you can actually get and place yourself. He's got a broken couch. Scrooge... You are a weird bird. He's got a game, a Tron chair? Some venom symbol? A TV, I can't turn it on though. Uh, that, that just, oh gosh, that's hilarious. Scrooge, you weird, weird, weird bird. <laughs> he really likes hearts, but he also likes death, apparently. He has a very, uh, Oh, he's, and he likes video games. All right, he likes retro games. Okay, so that was different. <laughs> All right. Oh man. Oh, this is this is this is cool. See, I I have a separate interior that I've been building out. That's not the my interior, and this is just it. it oh my gosh, I get so absorbed into this. I love it. Um. I don't know what it is. You don't fight anything. You don't have any puzzles or platforming challenges, but you just, it's just so much fun. Okay, so we have to do these. They don't have check marks, so let's do it. These are the simple, uh, simple things. This will probably give us more quests from other people roaming around too, like the Mad Hatter over there. Okay, show me how to add rooms, even though I already did. When you add a room, 
That's the thing, I already figured out so much of this game so on my own. <laughs> to add a room. Just by fooling around. Okay, let's go to the editor. Add a room. Okay, so we have to add a room somewhere. Rooms and hallways must be connected to doorways before the doors can be open. Okay, let's put this. Move the toy from side to side. Down here. Exit the toy box editor when you're done. Okay, I added a room. Each room you add to your interior can be customized and decorated. I didn't add a room. I added a, a hallway, but that's okay. No way! No way! That's so exciting. Okay, can I can I talk to him and do some more stuff? Mission complete. Okay. Co Cogsworth, do you have anything else for me? I know you had more stuff. What is going on? Okay, and also you'll see when you add a room, it has this very plain texture so the walls the trim the floors everything is very plain and so you can customize it with whoa you have a magic wand that's so cool uh so he's gonna show us how to do this theoretically he should but anyway you can go into a room and target the walls and no that's not what i wanted to do no hit the x button and you can give it all these different walls that you can see here. So you can give it Andy's walls from Toy Story, or Captain America walls, or uh, what is Doofenshmirtz Evil Incorporated? If you guys know, let me know. I'm guessing it's from uh, either uh, Gravity Falls or Phineas and Ferb, because those are, I think, the only two properties in Disney Infinity that I have never seen before. Oh, well, we have Gravity Falls. Doofenshmirtz, what would that be from? But anyway, you have all this stuff. All these cool different designs. Uh, my personal favorite is... Oh, Inside Out walls. That's very plain. I would think Inside Out would be a little more eclectic. Alright, my favorite... I do like the Snuggly Duckling. That's pretty adorable. But my favorite is Rapunzel's Tower. I just... I've told you guys too many times... Tangled is just amazing. If you haven't seen it, go see it because it's the best movie ever. Sweet. Alright, uh, Cogsworth, do you really not have anything for me? Really? C Cogsy? Cogsy boy? Alright, well then we're just gonna play around. We're just gonna play around. So let's add some rooms and I'm just gonna hang out and talk to you guys. Uh, what? Oh, what I was gonna say a little while ago was that I woke up this morning and I woke up looking like a total movie star, which never happens. I never wake up. I never look good when I wake. Right when I wake up, like my hair is a mess, and, and it's just all kinds of. It's just a mess. My hair is a mess. I got bags under my eyes. I'm just totally ridiculous. Uh, but this morning I woke up, and I looked like a total movie star. I looked. I looked perfect. I looked absolutely perfect. Which I was like, no, oh, this, this is too weird. This is too weird. This never happens to me. So, but it was pretty cool. I got, I gotta say, it was pretty cool looking like a movie star for a brief moment. Then I went and started going about my day and doing stuff, and uh, I, saw, I was recording. I've been recording today actually for a while because I tend to, I record in bulk. So you'll see sometimes uh, the Disney Infinity, Infinity videos have these big, uh, have the intros from the intro screen, and sometimes they just start inside the game. Uh, because I record in bulk. So anyway, here we are in the the wonderful Scrooge McDuck's money bin. And look, the coins fly up into the air when you run over them. Let's see if we can... Okay, we can't swim. We can't swim in the money. This isn't DuckTales. That's too bad. <laughs> but come on, every dream home has a secret vault of gold somewhere. Uh, so yeah, it was just cool waking up this morning. And so I've been recording uh, all morning and wearing headphones and stuff and so now my hair is all flattened down and yeah the perfect movie star look is gone unfortunately it was so weird i walked into the bathroom and i looked in the mirror i was like what what who who is that that's not me what is going on here but yeah that was, that was me it was really i was i was shocked i looked i had to i stared in the mi mirror for like five minutes because i didn't believe what I was seeing. Some furniture pieces are <clears throat> to be placed on All right, the floor. so now we're gonna Use okay. All right, to toy box furniture. editor. I'm trying to take Select a drink of water. Hang on. To place. You can move and rotate any piece of furniture. Okay, so those are ah uh, wall pieces. 
Windows. I need something that goes on the floor. Okay. Uh, uh, Place the furniture okay. you've selected. What do we want to put here? Odin's bed. Oh, that's cool. What do we want in the main lobby? Um, Agrabah throne. <laughs> throne of thought. What? Guys, does that look way too small for Thanos' throne? If you've seen the Avengers movies or Guardians of the Galaxy. Oh, I'm carrying Winnie the Pooh. Oh, not anymore. And rotate any piece of furniture. That looks way too small. The Maleficent's throne is... Okay, I, I see some... Uh, I see the developers put more work Place into some pieces than others. Alright, um... Oh, yeah, I was there. Um... You can move and accent and any decor. Piece of oh yeah, let's put some flowers here. The magic golden flower from Tangled. I told you guys I was gonna be a total fanboy every now and then. Uh, <laughs> okay, nowhere shrub. Oh, that's little Groot. That's little Groot. That's little Groot. Exit the toy oh box my gosh. when you're done. There are hundreds of furniture pieces it's that can be Groot. placed in your oh, interior. Oh, he's facing the wrong way. Look at him, it's Groot. Make it feel more like home. Aww. He's so cute. All right, we need to rotate him though. I hit, I hit the right button, right? Okay, there we go. There we go. Hey there, Groot. You're adorable. Okay. Ah, uh, now what? So I guess it just takes a while for Cogsworth to wake up and and give us some more quests. So let's play some more rooms so we have space to do stuff. Where are the rooms? But where are the rooms? There they are. Aha. All right, let's put in some hallways. I like the long halls better than the short halls. The short halls are too short. Oh, no, I went down too much. So rotating the camera is very, very useful in editing mode. Okay, so we can build over this. Great. Um, hmm. Hmm. All right, let's just put in some basic rooms to start. So, definitely want to have rooms that lead to other rooms because I don't want to have any dead ends yet. Except below, beyond the bookcase because that, that's fine. That's fine. Okay. What are some cool rooms? Look at that. That's pretty cool. So, you got... So you have doors with, or rooms with three doors, but you have this giant one, and you have a really small one. You have different options. So you have this tiny four-door room, or you have this long hall four-door room, or, oh, that's so cool. Look at that, it has a little, uh, little, little lower place. Oh, I like that. I like it. Let's put that on here. Yeah. I hit the A button, didn't I? Oh, there we go. Oh, wow, why? Okay, it booted me out of the rooms editor. That was weird. Okay. Well, I added another room. Okay. What's going on? Oh, this is so cool. I love interiors, guys. This is just... I don't know what it is. Something about designing a virtual home is just really exciting, especially when it's full of Disney stuff. Oh, look at the, look at the detail on the stairs. So, like, some of the steps... Are, are like bent or, or uh, lower or taller. Oh, I love that. I love it. I can't I can't articulate what I'm trying to say, but I love it. <laughs> oh man, this is so cool. Hey Pooh, Pooh Bear. Winnie the Pooh Bear. Oh, elevator getting away from us. Look at Pooh, he's so cute. And we can also drop kick the Pooh Bear. It's okay, he likes it. It's a, it's a game. It's a game. Okay, what is going on with you? Just met a guest who's a huge, huge fan of Iron Man. Decorate a room using the Stark Tech theme. Oh, it's Pepper Potts! Just for me. Okay, let's... There's a Stark theme. All right, let's see if we can we can do it. Stark tech. Okay, floor. Oh, Avengers Tower. 
the claw? Oh my gosh! That is so cool! <laughs> oh man. Uh, is there a stark light? Oh, there we go. Iron Man chandelier. The walls. Stark tag. Uh, and the accents. Okay, cool. Hey, I did a quest. I did a good. I did a good. Hooray. I'm not gonna leave it like that. I'm not. Eh. I want this room to be cozier. Yeah. That's okay. I did a quest. Now I can undo my quest progress. Oh, Scrooge! What's up, Scrooge? You've earned enough sparks to fill me money bin. That's that's my really sad Scrooge impression. Oh! Oh, I got a new sidekick, Darkwing Duck, so now I can use Scrooge or Darkwing. That's awesome. Okay. Uh, okay, yeah, yeah. So let's talk to him some more. I don't even know how long we've been going on this. Uh... Probably stop soon. I get so absorbed in this. Hang something on the wall, a portrait or a picture. I can show Some you how. Cogsworth, you are so walls. helpful. Okay, let's go. No, I want to go to. I want to go to this room. Let's put a. Let's put a painting in the hall. Let's Select do that. the wall object you wish to place. Wall object you wish to place. Slide the furniture along the wall. I, I have to get to the wall Slide stuff, the dude. Slide the furniture along the wall. Okay. Olaf. Let's put a poster of Olaf. Also be moved up and down on the wall. Okay. Oh, I don't have a good camera angle. Okay, selected. that's fine. Somewhere in here. Okay. Exit the toy box editor when you're done. Wall objects can only be placed yeah. where there is adequate wall space. Hi, Olaf. Oh. Incredible. That was incredible. Yeah, it was. It was so incredible. Okay, we need a good theme to go with Olaf, though. I don't think there's a Frozen theme, which is sad because the castle in Arendelle looks amazing. Uh. I think I'm just gonna go with Rapunzel's tower again. Yeah, I'm not seeing it. I'm not seeing it. Okay. And so hallways, I don't think hallways have lights. Okay, so hallways don't have light fixtures. That's okay. Hey, Olaf. Oh, wait, isn't there an Olaf theme? Isn't there? I don't know. Let's go to the. Okay, let's see if we can find out. Olaf, so yeah, there we go. Okay, this is Olaf's Olaf's hallway. For reasons unknown, it's so blue. In summer, it's just so blue in summer. I totally passed it, didn't I? Uh, Olaf's summertime floor. Oh, that's adorable. Just so cute. Summer getaway, feet complete, awesome! Oh look at the look at the ceiling. There's a bee. Bees a buzzing. Ah, oh, I love it. Okay, all right. Let's see what else Cogsworth has for us. Let's do one more one more thing. Okay, we did all those. Tell me about customization. <laughs> I already know how to do this, but let's let's, let's do it. You can customize the walls, floor, and trim in your interior rooms to look any way you want. All you need is the magic wand. Use the magic wand okay. to change um, the look of the walls, <clears> the trim, <throat> or the floors. Yeah, let's let's change that stark room again. Like Open ah! the packs and tools menu to select this the magic so cute. wand. Oh my gosh. Alright. Uh, Aim the magic wand at the walls to select them for customization. Okay. Let's do select what does the that category look like? for the customization you want to uh. Oh, let's do a oh, okay, mini, mini, you're uh <laughs> Okay, mini. Mini takes this stuff seriously. Uh Shane oh, Whoa. Alright. Enter targeting mode and aim the magic wand at the object. I'm want to already change. on the wall, bro. Already on the wall. Or already on the customizing. Whatever. Um Aurora's Cottage from Sleeping Beauty! No way! There's so much you can do in this game, I love it. Okay, so this is a Decorate disgustingly pink room. Oh, jeez. It definitely looks like Minnie, though. It's all up to you. Definitely looks like Minnie, okay. Yeah, that's... 
<laughs> oh my goodness, that is really kind of frightening. Okay, so that's going to do it for interiors for today. We are going to be coming back to interiors a lot. Just like play sets and other toy box stuff. Thank you guys so much for watching. Let me know in the comments below what's your favorite theme to use in the interiors if you played. Mine is obviously Rapunzel's Tower. I love it. I mean, look at the chandelier. It's got the lanterns from Tangled. Oh, jeez. I can't handle this. Okay. Anyway, let me know in the comments below what is your favorite interior theme to use. And thanks for watching, guys. Have an awesome day. I'll see you in the next video. And remember to always be fantastic.